at farm level, it's most certainly getting the data right and the hygiene. Over the last uh, 10, 15, probably more years, we've seen a process at uh, the farm level of consolidation of farms. Farmers have been motivated by money to reduce the cell count. Because I think one of the major challenges we see is that uh, the availability of skilled labour on farm is very difficult. Things can be done with antibiotics and once the supermarkets and the milk buyers get involved in it. And I expect the last change has been the change with training. So we see more and more farmers who want to train their staff. You, you just have to be good, you have to be doing all the things to make sure that the production is extremely efficient. E. coli, the coliforms and strep hubris has increased as a proportion. The real challenge we have with environmental mastitis is the bacteria are everywhere. So vaccines in the future are going to play a, play a very, very important role in controlling mastitis. And to have specific vaccines that, that cope with the major pathogens will be a very useful step uh, in being able to control mastitis on farm and cell counts.